What's going on, Richard Spinners? My name is Richard Ray's Man here. Back with another episode of Doom Mods. And today, well, it is starting to be Halloween, but I am thinking about, but I can't find any good Doom Mods to review for Halloween. So I decided to do for one that I've been previously wanted to do for a very long time, and this one is Paranoid. And by the way, if you guys don't know, this is a mod for half, that releases Half-Life into the Doom 2 engine. And don't worry, you get, you get confused with Black Sabbath album, that's the first time I heard about it, like, um, when I first heard the title Paranoid, I was like, confused if it was, like, um, supposed to be Black Sabbath the video game. Like, if you guys don't know the Black Sabbath song, um, um, Paranoid and that, it's one of the best ones. Like, I was up there with, um, Machine, f um, Machine Pigs and, um, Iron Man. So anyway, let's go get into the mod. There's Paranoid, Half-Life for Doom. Let's go on medium, because I don't care. Um, is this Half-Life? Is it Mission Briefing? What was it? Oh. <laughs> Walk softly, and carrying a big stack. So it was this one? Now using classic controls this time. Welcome to Black Mesa. No, we're entering to the sea and ominous. Oh, so it is like Half-Life, kind of. Let me just... Nah, I'm making more Half-Life. And for some reasons... What do I look like, actually? Oh. I don't look like Gordon Freeman. Maybe it's the default one, actually. So anyway, I'll put... I'll put it always on, and... Also, yeah, that's it. How interesting. Just look at that. What is correct? Don't you find this all rather fascinating? Yeah, so that life, everyone. In the Doom engine. <coughs> yes, this all looks nominal. Yeah. We're gonna put the alarm on. No, I can't. Yes, this all looks nominal. It looks pretty I good, actually. I am rather looking one forward one to this analysis. Sure. Sorry, sir. Aren't you? I've got to stay in my post. Right? This is pretty good because he's actually in three dimensional. Yes. This all looks nominal. The 3D models in the game, in this version actually, because I'm actually am using a, um, an early version of it. Because if you guys don't know, <laughs> if you guys don't know, I'm having actually having problems actually running the early, the newer versions of um GZ Doom, so I have to like, go for model. And this one's um one point. Uh, can I enter? I just can. Wow. I really played ha I played a little. Are you 100 sure that the yours is correct? Okay, I'm getting out of here. And I will probably do a. F I'm am going to do a full let's play on Half Life, so don't worry. Pretty sure GM is like, Seriously, 3D models, even in this version, I thought it won't work, but. Greetings. Hello. Greetings. Don't you find this all How interesting? Okay, I'm gonna skip it forward. I believe this one has a different um platform. You know I can't let you through here. Ah, oh, I forgot. Ah, uh, probably not because I only have full health. Oh, I forget what a point. Oh, look. Don't you find this all rather fascinating? Can move cheese? Actually, I actually need, I actually need to play back Mesa actually because I actually have. Oh, yeah. I could do like Duke Nukem thing. But I believe that's what Wolf and Doom, which I am gonna do. It's on my list. I'm gonna. I gotta download it on my computer, so that'll be probably when I might do my um let's plays on um Wolf and 3D, which is coming up by the way. Probably maybe when I'm done with Quake and that. Anyway, let's go back to the action. Greetings. Hello. Can I miss it with this guy's microwave? Oh, I can't. Okay. Well, that's good 3D models. No. Well, I think mean, those has really horrible programs. I believe... Why do they wear these ridiculous ties? Hello? That's where you get the room in this one. Alright. Oh, at least it has 3D torts. So can we go from here? Oh, we can't. I think for the jump through in this game, actually. I mean, let's go for the action anyway. Where is it? Oh. Get out of the way. Thank you. Wait, let's run. Remember. 
Oh yeah. Don't you think we should recalculate those resonance dampening? I am really looking forward to this analysis, aren't you? Okay. Yes. This all looks nominal. Because the good thing is it's not loading. Now that the flippable logos. Why well, I can't be Axis. Now let's go up here. Wow. Uh, like the way it has the old white old doom sound effect. I wonder if we're gonna do this with other like um mods, like maybe we're gonna like do it with like um Half Life 2. Hey soldiers. Still having good quality three models. You also like kill the scientists too when you have the weapon. Which I am going to do right now. The good thing is there's no loading signs, so Oh. No announcements. What is paranoid? That's it as well I am. Yes, yes. I am right now. Are you 100% sure that theory of yours is correct? Very difficult to aim in this game. No, I think this one has loading on it. Or not. Okay, it does. It just has a save point. <laughs> this looks different. Just look at that. I never. Hi, soldier. Good quality. I never played that much um, Black Mesa War Paranoid. I got explicit orders not to let you through without your hazard suit on. Alright, let's do it. Much different. I think this was based on like um, expansion actually. They made it more like offensive, and there's no seriously, there's no mirrors. I can't look at myself. Well, I am not Gordon Freeman after all. And I believe this is where the fun happens. I put on a suit. Welcome to the HEV. HEV. Mark 4 protective system for use in hazardous environment conditions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Communications interface online. Oh. oh yeah. Every warning, flammable reactor failure. I thought this happened when I left. Containment breach in progress. Please proceed to the area and evacuate the area. But there's a really long cutscene. Oh, yes, there's a long cutscene. No, there's aliens. From not alien. But there is a head crabs that might be like the face huggers. Oh, these more good sites, like an original Half-Life, which I actually did complete it by the way, but I can't do it like cheat codes because it's really hard to like um This is really unforgiving like there's soldiers in that like keep um shooting you like um dead on. Oh good. Yeah by the way. Let's see like um Can I move now? Finally. Let's go back to the action. I believe we can find this to around here. Whoa. Oh, that works. But you guys don't know, actually. Oh. Let's check out the gun. Okay, he deserves to die. Is it you? Probably not you. No! I don't want to die! No! Please! Oh, I think. Die and I be the. Put the crouch on. I think I'm more like half life now with the crouch. I need to add jump to. Oh! He's great, crabs, everyone. A valve. Oh, uh, funny thing is, we got valve software. I believe you can't shoot him. Yeah, you can't actually destroy wooden boxes, which is kind of annoying. Pretty good high quality, actually. Tough one. Sector Administrator to get the system override code. 
Oh, it's a British person. Did that to happen? And it's an explorer place. That's a cricket noise. Oh, I know, I know, dude. Fenton time. Yay! Actually, I always had those areas in Half Life. Like little claustrophobic. See me, my mighty crowbar. I think it's Gordon's. Yeah, his name's Gordon Freeman, by the way. Don't get confused with Morgan Freeman. Oh. What's that? Oh. Give me one more ammo. Well, I'm dead. Don't worry, I'll save you. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you can double. Security key is in security room B102, which overlooks storage bay A2. Use the lift in storage bay A3 to reach the bridge over storage bay A2, which will take you to B102. I don't know what he said, but I'm gonna go explore the place. I broke my end of the here anyway. It's getting a bit too long. It's quite late, so maybe after my, this video, I should probably go to bed. Oh, I'll do that anyway. So my name is Richard Ease, man. That was Paranoid for Doom, Half Life and Doom. <laughs> oh, anyway, my name is Richard Ease, man. Here, please subscribe, like, comment, follow me on Twitter, follow me on Tumblr, uh, add me on Steam and all that other stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And don't be paranoid. Bye.